<sighs> You're tuned into Football 360 News. Story of the day. Super Strikers ace goal scorer Shakes returns to training after he's a rip. All right. I'm ready. Shakes, amigo! Shakes. We're totally amped to have our star striker back, dude! But El Matador didn't go anywhere. Thanks, guys. I can't wait to score some goals. It's been way too long. Uh, you do know who we're facing next, right? <coughs> Park. Well, you don't need to worry about getting injured again, Shakes. Presenting the ultimate in soccer safety equipment! An airbag for your shins. I need someone to kick me. I'll do it, Klaus. <laughs> See? I am completely a ninja. Uh, <laughs> Ouch. What do you got for me, coach? Shakes? We, we need, need to, to test, test your match, match readiness, readiness before, before you rejoin, rejoin the, the first team. Match readiness test initiated. You're sure we aren't being a little tough on the guy, coach? If he can't take this, there's no way he'll handle Iron Tank. Match readiness rating, 25%. 50%. 75%. The moment of truth. Shake! Watch out, man! Match readiness test aborted. <sighs> you called it, Coach Ma. His physical injury is healed. But the emotional scar remains. You gotta be kidding me, coach! You honestly expect me to just sit and watch while the guys battle Iron Tank? Of course not. I have an important solo mission for you. Super Strikers, we write to you in a time of desperate need. Only you can help us. Open our brand new mall? It doesn't have to be a mall opening. Movie premieres, theme parks, old age homes, take your pick. I don't want to make celebrity appearances. I want to take on Uber. You're not ready. Pick any event you want. Go anywhere in the world. But get your mind off Iron Tank. Do I have to tell you not to play video games on the state of the art tracking screen? Oh, sir, sir, sorry, sorry, sir. Sir. Get back to work, you lazy dogs. Now, what is it you want to show me? Super Strikers have left for the Fortress Stadium. But Shakes is heading for China. Hmm. Suspicious. Keep me informed of all his movements. Well. Sure beats them all opening. Shakes! Shakes! Welcome to the Yellow Emperor's Palace, official home of the History of Football Museum. Uh, thanks? Oh, sorry, tour guide mode, force of habit. I'm Xing. Come on, let me show you around. The museum features soccer from throughout history. That's mob football from 16th century England. Any number of players, no rules. Invincible United are playing in the wrong century. The ancient Greek game of Episkiros was more like modern soccer, with one big exception. Players could use their hands. Yeah, and they didn't wear pants. This is all very impressive, but why'd you guys need me here? You're gonna be the guest of honor at the unveiling of our new exhibit. 
you get to cut the ribbon. <laughs> All part of the service when you call Soccer Stars for Hire. So, can I get a sneak peek? Sorry, no one's allowed to see the exhibit before the grand unveiling. But I suppose I can make an exception for shakes from Super Strikers. What is that? Football's oldest known predecessor, Kuju. Players had to keep control of a ball while fighting off crazy kung fu attacks. This tapestry tells the legend of a teenager who single-handedly defeated a whole team of soldiers. Man, this is too cool. <laughs> you ain't seen nothing yet. Come on! Welcome to the Yellow Emperor's Training Arena. Whoa! Kuju was the Super League of ancient China, and the Emperor wanted to make sure his team was the best. So, he built this place. <laughs> Sounds like Coach. I could show you some Kuju moves if you want, you know. To use against Uber if he tries to injure you again. Thanks, but, uh, Coach dropped me for the Iron Tank game. No ways. He doesn't think I'm ready to face Uber. Well, what better way to prove that you are than busting out some Kuju moves? No offense, but if I was going up against Iron Tank, I'd need to learn from a master. You know, long beard, flowing robes, in riddles does speak. Status report! Thor is about to break the club record! Not the game! Shakes! Sir, Shakes is under the history of football museum. I knew he was up to something. Iron Tank? Get ready to die! All right, then. Show me some of these Kuju moves, Master. Look around you, Shakes. Everything you need to learn is here. Oh! Ah! What are you doing? Come on! Pick up the pace. If you can't dodge me, how are you gonna dodge a whole team of muscle freaks? Tank? I'm guessing they're not here for the museum tour. Sorry, Shakes. Training is cancelled. What are you doing here? <clears throat> I was wondering the same about you, Shakes. But now I see what you're up to. You plan to use this fighting football against us. Uber, you stalker creep. I'm not even playing against you. Coach left me off the team. Yeah, sure. You can't lie to a master strategist like me. I know your every move before you make it. Bet you didn't see that move coming, master strategist. Get her! She will teach us the kuchu! <laughs> Or what? Yeah, 
Yeah, I thought so. Coach was right. I'm not ready. A teenager defeated a whole team of soldiers. Faster! Faster! Iron Tank will try to break your rhythm and dent your confidence. Uh, coach, that's not the only thing they'll try to break and dent. That's why you need to pick up the pace. If they can't catch you, they can't foul you. We don't need to worry about that anymore, Coach. I've got a new safety invention, the Slippery Spray. Someone kick me. <sighs> this again? <laughs> Ow! Oh, I gotta hand it to you, Klaus, man. That really works. Hmm. Didn't see that one coming. All right, back to practice. <laughs> back to the drawing board. Tell us the secrets of the ancient fighting soccer, or you're going for a long, cold swim. All right, all right. Close your eyes and all will be revealed. That doesn't make any sense at all. Kuju is an ancient sport, shrouded in mystery. It doesn't have to make sense. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> Why would I help you? You tried to end Sheik's career. End his career? Police! A master strategist would never use such a crude tactic. The tackle on Sheik's was just a way to implant a tracking chip. That's how they found me. Wait, if Uber put a tracking device in my leg, then... <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to another epic showdown live from the Fortress Stadium. Bad news for Super Strikers fans. Despite early signs that he'd be back from his injury, Shakes has not made the squad. Guys, you need to look after yourselves out there. We can't afford any more injuries. We're already one player short. Make that two, coach. Uh, where's Klaus? Let me guess. He's working on another safety invention? Huh? <laughs> Uh, Tiger is totally right. Uh, introducing my latest safety invention, this uh, suit of armor. You were hiding, weren't you? Yeah. The only way to avoid being injured by Iron Tank is to avoid playing them. You think this game will be less physical than the last encounter, Mac? I very much doubt it, Brenda. And by the looks of it, so do Super Strikers. They're keeping their distance from the tank. And it's working. Super Strikers have a chance here. <laughs> Goal! <laughs> but El Matador is down. If he isn't celebrating, it must be bad. Yep, the game's only just started, and the men in red are two strikers down. Close. You're going on. Yes, coach. Faster! Now, Iron Tank have a chance to attack Super Strikers' goal. Well, makes a change from attacking Super Strikers. Oh, spoke too soon. Here comes the cross, but it's way too close to the keeper. <gasps> or not. Uh -huh. <gasps> Iron Tank have barged their way back into the game. And with Shakes and El Matador out, Coach is going to need an ace up his sleeve to win this one. You can't 
give up now, Shakes. Um, in case you hadn't noticed, we're locked in a cell. Come on! That's nothing for Shakes from Super Strikers, right? doing here? Trained in an ancient temple, hitched to ride an iron tank submarine, you know, the usual. I specifically told you to get your mind off Iron Tank. Kinda difficult to do when they follow him around the world. Uh, this is Shing. She taught me an ancient soccer technique. Oh, way too How many times do I have to tell you, Shanks? It's not about your technique. Now sit down. You're not playing. Man, coach is scary. Tell me about it. Go, Klaus! You can do it! Come on, Lanky! <laughs> Give it your best, Rizzo. <clears throat> Don't make me tell you again, Shakes. I know. I'm not ready. But what other choice do we have? Shakes wasn't even in the squad. Then he's on the bench, and now he's playing? Hopefully he can last longer than his teammates did. Seems Shakes is more resourceful than we thought. Don't worry. He's too scared to face me. 80 minutes gone, and the scores are still tied. But Super Strikers still have some life in them. There's Shake's first involvement. Can he make the difference? Attack! Or will Iron Tank run him down again? Let's see how Kuju holds up in the 21st century. Amazing move from Shake! Go, Shake! Ah! Where is he coming up with this stuff? Remember the Kuju legend. Time to finish the job! believe that tiny chip caused that much trouble. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's smash the thing! Nah, I got a better idea. This is the first mission ever. Rich of finding. It will all be worthwhile when we find out what Shakes' new secret training is. Von Eye, how close are we? Oh! Over there! Dear Uber, bet you didn't see this coming. Whoa. <laughs> hey, 
man. Watch out, man. Here I come, man. I like to say, man, man. It's me, Shakes. You know, the guy who's always sticking his nose in other people's business. Blargar, blargar. Blah, blah, blargar. Yes, brilliant. Thanks, Tony. <laughs> Not you, Chuck T. Chipperson. My Technovision glasses. The glasses you are wearing are the perfect training device. I can loan any player from any team into your field of vision. I've even got managers, reporters, all kinds of stuff. I don't know, Tony. These things make me feel like I'm going crazy. Oh, wait. There we go. Better? Hi, Tony. Can I try the movie glasses? John J. Johnson, Jr., you're supposed to be sorting out the vermin problem. You don't need to worry about this cunt, Tony. I've taken care of it. The stink bag is finally gone? You'll never see that skunk again. <laughs> you give me those glasses right now! <laughs> Technovision isn't a toy. It should only be used for training. <gasps> or sabotage. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, I must be like 20 feet high. El Matador, you've scored 10 goals in four games. What is the secret to your phenomenal form? Well, Lena, when I look my best, I play my best. The shiny teeth. The giant head. The perfect hair. The incredible self-indulgence. And the finishing touch. My custom design, super expensive, one-of-a-kind glasses. Ooh. Ouch! Nobody touches the glasses. They're so copyright protected, if I try to make another one, I'd have to sue myself. Hurry up, El Matador. Coach is waiting. You can't rush perfection. Ugh. <laughs> Dude takes more showers in a day than I do in a month. Uh, well, it's working. Celebrity Stalker magazine says El Matador is the hottest player in the Super League right now. What? They were handing them out for free on the plane. Uh, no they weren't. We got here on the striker jet. My redesign worked. It's the perfect replica. With a bit of Technovision magic, of course. Huh? Oh, uh, I'm looking great. Hey, hey. Gonna score lots of goals today. You a skunk! I'm getting out of here. The skunk. My glasses feel kind of weird. Did you guys mess with them? Nobody touched your glasses, man. Yeah, don't want to get sued. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's get down to business. First of all, we'll map up a defensive response. Tony? We'll expect a tight defense around the goal. Nope, but there. A staggered defense. Tony even lets super strikers use the movie glasses. Hmm. If I can't use the movie glasses, Maybe I can make the movies. <laughs> it's showtime! Technicali have been very good in attack, overwhelming the opposition with their numbers. But pushing all their men forward leaves the defense exposed. Huh. And we got just the man to make them pay. Right, El Matador? Huh? Mm -hmm. El Matador! I swear something feels weird about my glasses. <sighs> Let's do it, guys. We got to be prepared for Technicali. Yeah. Who knows what that madman Tony Verne is up to? Day one. It stinks so much. I have stuffed El Matador's socks into my nose to block out the smell. It isn't working. I got it! <laughs> no, 
What should I do for my first scene? El Matador! Can I get a photo? Uh, who do you work for? I only appear in A-list magazines. Uh, um... Ponytail magazine? Oh, of course. <laughs> Just make sure you get my goods. Ah, and cut. What a scene. John J. <gasps> Johnson, Jr.? <laughs> What are you doing in my lap? Oh, nothing, Tony. <laughs> Ew! What's that smell? I don't want to talk about it. A matador! I was wide open. Sorry, Shakes. I was going to pass, but that reporter wanted my photo for the cover of Ponytail Magazine. <laughs> uh, what reporter, dude? That guy, right over... Huh? He must have already got what he needed. I am very photogenic. Anyway, a good practice, guys. I'm gonna go take a shower. Did you guys see a reporter? <laughs> <gasps> According to Pointless Gossip Magazine, El Matador is showing all the signs of a celebrity breakdown. I bought it for a friend, okay? Oh yeah? What's his name? Never mind that. It says that the clear signs of a complete mental breakdown are paranoia. He was convinced someone touched his glasses. Hallucinations. Like the invisible reporter from Ponytail Magazine. <laughs> Anything else we should be looking out for, man? An urge to trash hotel rooms. <gasps> How about locker rooms? What? I'm sorry, El Matador, but this is for your own good. What is? A celebrity intervention! Get him! Uh, how many times do I have to tell you guys? Some mysterious intruder messed with my glasses, a skunk trashed our locker room, and the reporter took my photo at practice. Uh, denial is a clear sign of a celebrity breakdown. You guys are just jealous that they chose me for the cover of Ponytail Magazine. I looked it up. There's no such thing as Ponytail Magazine. Yeah, dude. Ponytails went out of fashion in the 80s. How dare you? Uh, Shakes, you believe me, right? Uh, I... I uh... Fine. I'm going to go hang out with someone who knows what it's like to be a big superstar. <laughs> all right, all right, we get it. That went well. <sighs> I'll go speak to him. Well, hurry up or you'll lose him, Shakes. Well, not unless you know the big superstar he's going to hang with. But we are in Hollywood. That could be anyone. Don't worry. There's only one big superstar El Matador listens to. Oh, El Matador. It's tough being a misunderstood, rich, incredibly handsome soccer star. I know how you feel. Huh? John J. Johnson Jr.? Tony never trusts me to do anything. But he's not here. <laughs> but I still believe in myself, no matter what anyone says. Uh, do you always go out dressed like that? Uh... The 80s are back. Spandex is totally fashionable. <laughs> you should tell that to Norshaw. My ponytail is so in. Congratulations on making the cover of Ponytail Magazine, by the way. Why, thank you. Hey, how did you know about that? Uh, news travels fast in Hollywood. OK, this is my big chance. What do all good movies need? <gasps> Drama. El Matador, what's wrong? Uh, my teammates think I've gone crazy. Say, do you hear that music? Mm-mm. Drama. Check. What else? Action! Mm -hmm. <laughs> you ninjas! What are we gonna do, John J. Johnson Jr.? What do you want? We are jealous of your awesome ponytail. Give it to us or face the consequences. You want my ponytail? Come and get it. So be it. Bro, we're bros, and bros shouldn't fight. Right, bro? Nah, lame. El Matador, we're all just worried about you. C come back. 
Sound like his mom. El Matador, being in a team is all about trust. What I'm trying to say is, I don't think you're... Huh? Crazy. Shakes! Help! El Matador? Oh, God. This isn't over, El Matador. Your point there will be ours. <laughs> <laughs> Shakes, and those evil ninjas were after my ponytail. El Matador, I think you should look at this. Huh? <laughs> oh, man. Klaus was right. I am having a celebrity breakdown. A game against Technicali. It's tomorrow. Oh, Shakes, what am I going to do? Maybe you need to sit it out? You wouldn't tell Coach, would you? Dude. We have a chance to beat Technicali on their home turf. Come on! I'm your friendly, super reliable gold getting strike partner. I'll be fine. <laughs> Match day at the hub. And it looks like Technicali are sticking to their attacking formation. With El Matador in red hot form, they'll be torn apart. So, Shakes, dude. What happened with the Lord of the Shower Rings over there? Yeah, is he seeing things all way? Is he in the right frame of mind to play? Well... Hey, guys! Yeah? What are you talking about? Yeah, uh, like I was saying, he's totally fine. Day two. The smell isn't going away. But I must remain focused on my mission. All right, El Matador, it's showtime! And we're off. <laughs> Cheeky shakes! And highly effective. <laughs> El Matador has an early opportunity here. He's clean through. Huh? Where'd you guys come from? From your worst nightmare. Shakes, back to you! Instead of shooting, El Matador passes to a marked man! It works! I'm a genius! I was wide open, dude. Yeah, I know. Oh. Oh, trouble here for Super Strikers. Electrifying stuff from the Technicali boys. Technicali achieve on their first try what El Matadors failed to do the entire half. Dude, you're not handling the pressure. I gotta tell Coach about... Ah, whatever, Shakes. It's like John J. Johnson Jr. said. I gotta believe in myself no matter what anyone says. Wait, when did you see him? Uh, last night, just before the ninja attack. He wasn't real, was he? <laughs> but if El Marigo wasn't lying about the skull, then... John, who's on the cover of this month's Ponytail Magazine? El Matador, obviously. Uh, I mean, i uh, never heard of Ponytail Magazine. Uh, gotta go. Bye. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Shakes knows about Technovision. Oh, I gotta fix this. Hey, I thought those glasses were only meant for training. Tony? Why did Tony ask us to meet him here? Tony! To Ooh. Oh, yes! Much better! What have you done? It wasn't me. It was the skunk. I'm talking about El Matador's glasses. I thought you might need a little help with, uh, you know, winning. Oh. oh, quit moaning. You have a goal. But I want goals fair and square. Now listen, El Matador is being subbed as we speak. Hang back, defend your lead, and the game is yours. Any questions? Yeah. What's that smell? Oh. I think it's obvious that one of us has a serious problem. 
All right, I admit it. I am addicted to the gossip magazines. I need help. You were talking about El Matador, weren't you? Guys, I just saw a skunk. Uh, good for you, dude. Don't you get it? It means El Matador wasn't lying about trashing the locker room. And that's not all. John J. Johnson Jr. knows about Ponytail Magazine. How would he know about a made-up magazine? Because he's the one who made it up. So what is going on? Whoa, whoa, easy there, brother. <gasps> oh, God. Okay, keep cool, John J. Johnson Jr. You gotta get to El Matador before Shakes does. Hmm? Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, El Matador. Uh, listen, buddy, I'm not feeling that good, so when I come back into the change room in a moment, I may be acting a little crazy. Ha! You know the rules, Shanks. Uh, I'm calling my law. Oh. <laughs> hmm? So you just ignore everything I say. We need you on the field for the second half. Okay, he's gone. Huh? Tony Byrne swapped your glasses for some kind of VR projection goggles. I... I'm not crazy. Can you play without your glasses? No, coach. Then I'm gonna have to sub you. Uh, Tony Byrne sabotaged my game and made you guys think I was crazy and worst of all, touch my glasses. Uh, you gotta let me get back at him. Hmm. The two sides emerge for the second half, and first out is El Matador. I'm surprised he's on the field at all after his terrible first half performance. They didn't sub him? Oh, well, El Matador, you're about to find out what this baby can really do. El Matador on the attack. Can he find some form in the second half? Ha! I'd be surprised if he can even find the ball the way he's been playing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you got past two players. Here's ten more! What's he gonna do, people? He's gonna pass to himself. Oh! Tech Division is meant to make him worse, not better! How about some special effects to liven things up? <laughs> Touches the glasses. Tail magazine. <laughs> That'll do. Back to me. <laughs> Eat this, Fido. Amazing. Unbelievable. than being crazy. <laughs> Sorry we didn't trust you, man. Ah, don't worry. It was Tony's fault. Are we going to teach that sucker a lesson? Well, Spiteful Teen Magazine has an article on the 10 best ways to get back at an ex-BFF. Don't worry, guys. I already know how to make Tony pay. 
get your high-tech augmented reality technoglasses right here? Uh, at least I can make my money back on these stupid things. <laughs> Boss, I found some people interested in the movie glasses. Ah, welcome, welcome. And who do I have the pleasure of doing business with? El Matador's lawyers. We're here to talk to you about copyright infringement. <gasps> what is that smell? I <sighs> don't want to talk about it. Scores 2-0 to Super Strikers, and Big Bo's had nothing to do all game. Oh! Ah! Ah! Nakata are in Super Strikers' box! Woo! Ah, nothing to get excited about, Brenda. Block is there. But if he doesn't get this tackle right, it's a penalty for sure. for the big man. Block's the cleanest tackler in the Super League. You rock, Block! A turbo! Yeah! Yeah! Right, right on, man! Listen up, guys. The Robotics in Football exhibition is coming up next week. Prof? Oh, uh, well, we thought we'd do something special this year, so I've made a robot. Of one of you. Huh? Ah, hmm? uh, hmm. must be cool Joe. He does the best robot! <laughs> it must be me! Why replicate anyone less good-looking than the great El Matador? Huh? Huh? Ooh. Introducing... Roblox! Tony, why does this tin can get to travel with the team? Cuz, unlike you lot, Chip T. Chuckerson is going to win me a prize. The game? Against Super Strikers? Oh, the other difference between Chip and you lot is he can actually learn things. Copy movie star. I need your clothes, your boots, and your shin guards. Um, I don't understand, Tony. He's gonna win me the robotics and football exhibit. Iron Tank are already the perfect robots. Ow! No foul, Cleon. No foul. And, and the Robotics, the robotics in, football in Football Grand, grand Prize, prize goes, goes to... to... Yes? Yes? Roblox! Yeah. What? Block, hmm? a quick a interview, interview, perhaps? I can translate if you want. Been learning Brazilian. Tell me about your robot twin. <laughs> Physically, Roblox is a perfect copy of me. How could they give the award to the robotic dimwit? He's just a mindless replica. So, how's this football? <laughs> I don't know. Prof says playing against Roblox would be extremely dangerous because he's all steel and hydraulics. Oh, really? So what will he be doing at Strikerland? Welcome to Strikerland, home of the Super League's greatest team. Ah, a tour guide. So, who do you predict will win this weekend? Super Strikers or Technicali? I predict Super Strikers will prevail in our next game. Nice. Block? Circle block, that's the blooper. Um, I'm only halfway through the Brislovian course. Uh, but if you ask me, Lena, I just need to score one goal, and Block will take care of the rest. Not if I take care of Block first. Copy. Block. Block, sir. <laughs> Block, sir. <laughs> now, if I could just figure out how to get your processor into that lumbering pile of nuts and bolts. Stop! First law of robotics, no water. Water will make you malfunction. But you have given me an idea. 
technology from previous inventions. For example, I use the analytical algorithm from the magic of Roblox eyes. Water! Get Roblox out of here! Go! Go, chick! Go! exhibit has been locked down with all robots inside. No, no, no! There was so much he still had to see to do. Shuh, that was one awesome robot block, Prof. In hindsight, it would have been difficult to make a robot as good looking as me. This sucks. Schmeigelfleur. Clear all robot parts. Send those tin cans to the scrapyard. Yes, it worked. And by the time Super Strikers realize they're playing with a robot, half the team will be injured. <laughs> Let's put the robotics exhibit behind us, okay? I don't want it affecting our performance against Technicali. Now, get to it. El Matador? Oh. Uh... My preparation will be purely mental, Coach. Reminding myself how awesomely amazing I am. <sighs> hey, Block. I reckon the best practice I can get is against the world's best defender. You. you seem different. I think I'll do some training where I won't end up in hospital. Oh! These super strikers are too fast and skilled to be injured by Roblox. Hmm? But my players aren't. John J. Johnson Jr. Hi, Tony! I've come up with a strategy for you. Great. Let's hear it. Dribbling. Ah, uh, again? I thought the doctor cleared that up. He means dribbling a soccer ball. I want you to dribble straight at block, John J. Johnson, Jr. Isn't that kind of risky? With Roblox on the pitch, there'll be cards for Super Strikers and penalty kicks for Technicali. <sighs> I am Roblox, the robot block. The true legend is over there. Danger! 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 Danger. <laughs> Welcome to Strikerland, home of the Super League Trophy. Let's begin our tour. Circle. Okay, boys, let's call it for today. Be the block. What's up with you? You seem different. Hey, block. You coming? Surely, lad. Something's up with block. He's playing weird, speaking weird. Shaw shakes, dude. It's not like you're an authority on Brislovian. Yeah, brother. Aren't you still learning? <laughs> Cassette tape? Yeah, latest technology in Breslovia. <laughs> <laughs> Hey! 
Okay, tape six. Huh? Weird. Where are six to nine? Are you ready for the final level of Learn Brislovian? Here we go. Rarl clad zuzangle crad blook to rasburko. Got it. Huh. If my Brislovian isn't dodgy, then what's up with block? Next up, Zorg Lang Berserkle Oh! Tapes! Block the rug! Block! One of our main values at Striker Land is determination. It's much day in the fight club. No matter where you are, whatever you're doing, it's a fantastic day for a bit of football. Super Strikers have been looking good, but Chuck T. Chipperson is in great form. Block will need to be on top of his game, Mac. I'm sure he will, but uh, he's so reliable. Always there when Super Strikers need him. <laughs> Block! We need to talk. Purple. Zergle Purple Gerb? The rather Grinlock, to Colonel Ferboombra. He says he's been under a lot of pressure lately. Wow, Chicks. Your Brislovian has really improved. Yeah, totally. <laughs> <laughs> Block! I know something's wrong. Your game, your Brislovian, it's like you're a different person. Pixelblogger, grab the goal. Excuse me? Pixelblogger, grab the goal. Huh? You took my tapes. But why would you need to learn Brislovian? <laughs> because you're not Block. You're Roblox. You can't go out there. You, you can't play. You'll hurt people. Roblox, listen to me! Please remember to look after your belongings during the tour. And last out, last week's man of the match, Block! Oh, no! He's a machine, Brenda. Well, where's Shake? Aye. Thought we had a first choice 11 on both sides. Klaus, warm up. Eagle Eye, Grizz, get shakes. Oh, uh, what's the strategy again? Uh, you run straight at block. Oh, right. striker to do business with Block. <laughs> wow. So unlike Block. Yes! <laughs> I mean, what was that? Whatever happened to fair play? Keep it tidy, Block. Another one, and the card's coming out. Shakes! Shakes! I don't get it. Where did he go? A belligerent brute! Oh, the ref is reaching into his pocket and... It's a yellow card! He's ruining his hard-earned reputation in a single game! Please stay near. Do you need the restroom? It's down the stairs, first left, second right, immediate right, and straight ahead. <laughs> Next up, the Strike Lounge Ball! Isn't it total luxury? Who 
Well, folks, all good things must come to an end. You want more? Follow me for the final part of our exciting tour. And it gets worse. The big defender. Penalty huh? to technicality. Lock best clean up his act soon, or he'll be sent off. Fasten your seatbelts, because the final stop on our tour is the Strike-A-Land Garage. Technicali go one ahead. All thanks to a surprisingly poor performance from Block. Who would have thought? First a missing striker. Now a defender whose brain's gone missing? North. Uh, uh, Shakes? Don't let anyone know I've been here. That's not Block. It's Roblox. Yeah, and I always take advice from dudes hiding in lockers. He put me in here. You find out you're onto him and you're next. You need to get him out of here. Block, what is wrong with you? Fix a blogger. Grab the boom. Oh, I know this one. Block's uh, hitting the showers. Right, Block? Since when do you speak Breslovian? I've been taking night classes. That isn't Block. It's Roblox. Hmm. Yeah, right. The dangerous tackling, weird Brislovian, cold, steely demeanor? Well, we're about to find out if I'm right. Why is that, Shakes? Robots don't take showers. <laughs> So if that's Roblox, where's Blow? <laughs> Super Strikers drive only the coolest vehicles. Well, there's our tour guide. Someone switched the robot's processors. Shakes, you were right, dude. But where is Block? <laughs> He says we've got to go on for the second half, or we'll forfeit the game. Don't worry, he's got this. Can't wait for him any longer. Huh? huh? They didn't sub him? Looks like your work isn't done, John J. Johnson Jr. Block! Uh, you did it! Uh, I think. The second half is about to start, and Super Strikers have a lot of work to do. Well, Coach should have started by subbing Block. He's the reason they're losing. Woo! Block's gonna finish John J. Johnson Jr. once and for all! And get what he deserves, a red card. Vintage block! Smooth, slick, and effective! Oh! I'm too clever! My invention has learned to play like the best defender in the league! <laughs> Sorry, Tony, you're wrong. No one can play like the block. Largo Zerdo! Largo Blog Zerdo! No! 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 Wow, what a turnaround! 
never was trouble in block in the first half is ancient history. Nice one, brother! Oh, you did it! And where is your very scary twin? So I'm hanging from strike the land Roblox about to ditch me, when suddenly I remember something. My new robot friend. And now for the final part of our tour. Ta-da! Be the fly. I need to close. Smile the Eh, I think Prof should just make a robot that looks like me next time. But how do we know we aren't all robots already? We're into the final few minutes at the cauldron. Super Strikers are throwing everyone forward. They're desperate to find the Equalizer. But Grimm's ghoulish defense is holding firm. If anyone can break through, it's El Matador. Super Strikers number 20 has done everything right today. Everything except score a goal, that is. Precision through ball from Dancing Rasta. Shakes draws the defense. It's an open goal! Woohoo! <laughs> Feel the beauty! What? Oh, dude. Oh, so embarrassing. Huh? El Matador was so busy celebrating, he didn't bother to check if the pool went in. Oh, this is not going to be good for his confidence. It's over for me. Goodbye forever, soccer. Suck it up, bro. We all have a bad game now and then. Ah, you guys don't get it. I'm not special anymore. I'm just a regular player. Like the rest of you. Mm -hmm. uh, read some fan mail, dude. That'll cheer you up. Okay, man. I'll get on to that pronto. We'll see you at training, right? Yeah, yeah. See you there. De Los Santos, how confident are you feeling ahead of Azul's trip to Strikerland? Stopping Super Striker's attack is always a challenge, Lena. But I am feeling up to the job. <laughs> <laughs> ah, show off. Well, he does have the stats to back the confidence. That's why we'll be playing with three Strikers. Shakes, Klaus, and... Uh... Where is El Mando? Yeah, where is he? I haven't seen him. He had better have a good reason. Hello, you've reached El Matador. I will be unavailable forever. Oh, hey, man. Still this? Don't leave a message, and I won't get back to you. Goodbye. Still down about that miss, eh? Yep, moping at home. Huh. Well, there goes our three striker strategy, brothers. Hmm. Jakes, Klaus, come with me. I have a plan. El Matador's confidence has taken a major hit. I'm counting on you to get his mind right before the Azul game. I don't know, Coach. It's gonna take something big to get through to him. Whoa. Oh, oh. Welcome to our football technology vault. I always wondered where you kept this stuff, Coach. So, we put on the robo suit, grab El Matador, and bring him back, right? <laughs> Not quite. Activate Narcissus Protocol. I had a state-of-the-art device created especially for this kind of situation. Ooh, what does it do? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Just find El Matador, press the button, and the device will do the rest. And I thought my place was untidy. Hmm. <gasps> hmm? Dear El Matador the Great, forget what everyone else says, that miss wasn't your fault. It was obviously a bad pass from Shakes. Hmm. Come join your real fans. We believe in you no matter what. 
He wouldn't have. He, he, he couldn't have. His hair dryer isn't here. He never goes anywhere without it. Oh, he did. I don't know, Coach. He's somewhere in the middle of nowhere. The don't worry, we'll get him back. Ooh, I can't wait to see what this baby does. Forget about the device, Klaus. We need to focus on getting El Matador back in time for the game. Hmm. It could be a fold-up helicopter. <gasps> or a hypnosis device. <gasps> Maybe it's a teleporter. A flux capacitor? A spaceship for ants? The world's smallest spotlight? A robotic homing pigeon? A Rubik's sphere? A gravity disruptor? VR projector? A trans-dimensional day spa? A silver snitch? A bright destroyed? A Pokeball? Portable universe? Alien egg? Self-aware magic eight ball? <gasps> I have to know! <laughs> Must find out what it does. Oh! <laughs> ah! <gasps> Too close. Shakes his right. I have to focus on getting El Matador back in time. Back in time. <gasps> Klaus, we're here. Hmm? Gah, where did he go? <laughs> well, this is definitely the place. There's something fishy going on in there, Junior. Um, I'm looking for a friend. Uh, glasses, ponytail... There are many on board, but only one. Right. <laughs> Thanks. Watch out, Junior. Everyone in there is crazy. Last stop. Everybody off. Ugh. Get El Matador back in time. The question isn't where am I, but when am I? Of course, a time machine. to find El Matador, but this is ridiculous. What? Okay, Shakes, activate the device and get El Matador out of here. Easy as... Klaus? Do not be alarmed by my strange clothes and futuristic haircut. I am a time traveler. Oh, great. Another crazy. I don't see anyone else here. First the ponytail guy, then the cheeky one with the spiky hair. The ponytail guy? Yes, the perfect place to get away from yourself, the past. Very clever, El Matador. Uh, where or when did the ponytail guy go? Rejoice! Our king is here! Feel the duty! Feel the duty! <laughs> Almost. It's feel the beauty! Duty! Beauty! Duty? Eh, close enough. See? We are your best fans! Huh? 
The shame! Look! <gasps> he mocks the Great One with this incorrect jersey number. What? This the only one in the shop. Mm. Come on, people. <gasps> Feel the duty? He's not worthy of the mighty El Matador. No! No! The team. No! 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 Fine. I didn't even want to be part of your stupid club anyway. Sheesh. Those people won't let me anywhere near El Matador. <sighs> Our king is bored and demands entertainment. Who will step up for the skills battle? Winner will be given one-on-one -on -one face time with El Matador himself. Yeah! Gotcha. My shirt! My glasses! My pants! My dignity! <laughs> Others challenge for an audience with the king. I do. Huh? <gasps> <laughs> there is only one explanation for this. All the El Matadors from every point in time have gathered here. <sighs> but I need the real El Matador. <laughs> Good luck, challengers! Wow, this guy knows his stuff. <laughs> One of us? Shakes? What are you doing here? You have to come back to strike a land, El Matador. We need three strikers to get past De Los Santos. Uh, I'm sorry, Shakes. My place is here now. My people need me. But super strikers are your people. Unworthy! Off the team! Uh, El Matador, come on! Please! El Matador! I'm sorry, my friend, but this is best. For me, and for Super Strikers. This one is big trouble. I don't want him coming back. <laughs> Let me out! Let me out! Let me... <sighs> Klaus! Thank goodness! Where did you go? I think you mean, when did I go? Huh? What are you talking about? Well, it's obvious that El Matador is hiding in the past. That's why Coach gave us the time machine. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Oh, really? Well, what's your big theory then, Shakes? El Matador started a weird fan club consisting entirely of El Matador lookalikes and plans to rule them like a king. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Look, man. Who they are, or when they are, isn't important. What matters is that we get El Matador back. Well, what are we waiting for? Or Raza? Don't say it, dude. When are we waiting for? Yeah. All right, people, one more time. From the top, feel the beauty. Feel the beauty. Uh, I give up. Hey, El Matador. Oh, feel the duty? We are here to take our El Matador back to the present and the future. Or is that back to the future which was the present? Huh? Get them! Yeah. Let's find out what this thing really does. If you're watching this, you're in trouble. We all feel lost from time to time. Perhaps you have lost the keys to your Lamborghini. You might have lost your socks. It's not a time machine? <laughs> Brilliant. 
The only person El Matador listens to is himself, so Coach made an El Matador hologram to convince him to come back. Then it seems to be working on all of them. Or you're lost contemplating your own beauty. Perhaps you are lost in time, lost in space, and me. But remember, you are the greatest player of the age. Super Strikers need you because, like a Lamborghini, without the key, they just aren't as good. Come on. Come on. I don't want to, 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 I don't want to. Oh, crazy! You need to fulfill your destiny at Strike Alive. Help me, El Matador. I am my only hope. You heard the glorious ponytailed leader? Super Strikers need us! Yeah! 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 Striker Man! Man! have got me back to Striker Land, but I'm not playing. Hmm. You did use the hologram, right? It should have worked. We used it all right, just not how you intended. What are you talking about? Uh, you wouldn't believe me if I told you? The Azul fans are looking confident today, folks. Well, I would too if I had the mighty De Los Santos in goal. <laughs> Odd, though, that Coach has opted to keep El Matador on the bench. Yeah. Tough to see Super Strike is getting past Azul's keeper without it. Early chance for Super Strike us. What a shot! But not enough to beat De Los Santos. Fun warm up. <laughs> when are we gonna start playing for real? Shakes and Klaus are giving it their all. It's not enough! De Los Santos is just too good! I have an idea. It's an oldie, but a goodie. We're almost at the end of the first half. Can Shakes and Klaus finally get past De Los Santos? Shakes hits the post! And the ball goes straight to Klaus! Come on, Shakes. You beat me with that trick before. It's going to take much more than that to beat me again. Oh. Hate to say it, Coach, but this isn't working. Yeah, we need three strikers out there. We need El Mar Don't even say his name. I don't want to see any more of that guy. Yeah, we may have accidentally played the hologram message to a bunch of crazy El Matador fans. Field duty! <gasps> Woo! That's it. I'm calling security. Coach, hang on a minute. I think there's a way we can use this. Field duty! My people! I knew you'd come to get me. And that's not the only good news. Really? Yeah, we found your replacement. Ah! I always knew I had it in me to be the best El Matador ever. That's what you wanted, right? No, 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 Coach. These are just fans who adore Wonderful. me. Wonderful. With you on board, <laughs> De Los Santos has no chance. Hey, why don't we give Mel Matador's locker? Oh, perfect. We even have the same number. Yeah, sounds yeah, good. Mm -hmm. good Unless you mind, El Matador. No, not at all. Oh, well, in that case, we can give him your hair dryer too, right? He is the one on the pitch, man. His hair needs to look better than yours. <laughs> That's it. There are plenty of people who look like me, but there is only one El Matador. Prove it. Huh? I'll put you on, but if you don't produce the goods, I'm going to replace you with the El Matador who really wants to be here today. Me, 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 me. Come on, my people. Let's go and beat 
Let's do this! Oh, right. Yeah! Half-time substitution for Super Strikers. Coach brings on El Matador. We're well into the second half. Scorers are tight, and Super Strikers are on the attack again. But this time, they've <laughs> unleashed their full firepower. Brilliant build-up play. But it doesn't count for a thing if they can't get it past De La Santos. Klaus shoots. De La Santos saves. She latches onto the rebound. De La Santos saves again. But, but here, here comes, comes El Matador. Matador. Beauty! <laughs> El Matador really is one of a kind. Uh, someone needs to tell them that. <laughs> it's so beautiful! <laughs> it's good to be me! Yes, yes. Come on, come on, huh? Oh, forget it! I'll get my fish from the supermarket. Oh, man. Clean your locker day is the worst. Shakes! <laughs> hmm. I suppose my locker is a little untidy. No ways! My adventure annuals! I loved these when I was a kid. Oh, this one's my favorite. About a hundred years ago, a Brazilian businessman named Albert Douglas Ventura took on the most insane football project ever. Building a stadium in the middle of the Amazon jungle. Ooh. But the extreme location made construction a nightmare. His crew bailed on him but Ventura stuck it out, refusing to abandon his dream. You do know that's totally made up, right? Yeah, of North. course. Pfft. The Lost Stadium is totally real, Shakes. Oh, yeah? And where's Ventura now? He never returned from the jungle. Anacondas, piranhas, panthers! The Amazon is a dangerous place. Brazil has something even more dangerous than all of that. And he's coming to strike a land. Match day at Strike a Land. And Super Strikers are struggling to deal with Commentary Starman. The Master of Flair. The Samba King. John Aldo. Welcome to the end of the road. Hello. You think you can stop my samba style? That's cute. There's a blow! Yeah, you ain't getting past us this time. Ha, you still don't get it? When you're as skilled as me, you do as you please. Ha-ha! <laughs> the Brazilian maestro has made the league's best defenders look like amateurs. They had no answer for his unpredictable style. North Shore, you'll never stop Donaldo by diving in recklessly. You need to focus on the ball, not the man. Yeah, not the ground either, dude. This isn't good, man. Donaldo seriously damaged their confidence. That's an understatement. 
We've got one defender who's playing too aggressively and another who isn't playing at all. Come on, Block. Just one tackle, a little one. Please? He says he's fine. As long as his teddy sharing him helps him practice. Those two need a break. A chance to get their heads back in the game. How are we going to do that and get them to Rio in time for the return leg? I think I have a way. <whistles> North, Block, I'm sending you on a confidence building session in the Amazon before the game. A jungle adventure? At a luxury hotel. What? But it's the Amazon jungle, coach. It's meant to be about danger and excitement, not room service and little tiny shampoo bottles. The hotel has all the facilities and privacy you'll need to focus on stopping Donaldo. And who are we meant to play against? The bellboy? The world's greatest strike force. <gasps> Have I ever told you guys I was a junior wilderness cadet? I promise to use my cadet survival skills to keep us safe in the Amazon. Yeah, Klaus. Maybe you can get your ordering room service badge. Uh, I got that one ages ago. You gotta try to make the most of the situation, dude. Whatever. And here's my Junior Wilderness Cadet Navigation badge, my Campfire badge, my Air Guitar badge, my Mime badge, my Listing Things badge, my Crochet badge, my Life of the Party badge, my Pancake Eating badge, my Growing Up badge, my Not Understanding Social Cues badge. Whoa. This is gonna be epic. Glad to see you're making the most of the situation. No point in complaining. Yep. Totally gonna make the most of the situation. Come on out. This jetty has been certified safe by a junior wilderness cadet. Hold up, North. Coach said someone from the hotel was meeting us here. Come on, the place is just around the corner. Besides, we need to start practicing ASAP. Right? Yeah, but... We got our gear, we got the players, all we need is the pitch. Okay, but only if you're sure you know where the hotel is. Don't worry, dude. I know exactly where we're going. Dancing Rasta. That was the hotel. North and the others didn't make their rendezvous. What? They're somewhere in the jungle. You're in charge till I get back. But coach, they're lost in the Amazon. That'll be like trying to find... Uh, some guys lost in the Amazon. Then I'd better get started. Um, what is that stuff? Oh, this? Volcanic ash and... Watermelon. Yeah, I fly some unusual jobs. You're hired. Name's Mara. Where are we headed? North, didn't you say the hotel was right around the corner? Chillax, it's a big corner. Uh, yeah, well, what is that? I've got the Junior Wilderness Cadet Sound Identification Badge. It's a panther growl. No, 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 no. It's a wind. Hmm, perhaps thunder? I've got it. It's a waterfall. <gasps> Have you done? 
Why would we want to hang out in some lame hotel when we could go on an epic adventure? Huh? You didn't. That's right. We're gonna find the lost stadium. That's insane. It's a made-up story. It doesn't exist. Um, Shakes? My junior wilderness cadet observation skills tell me that it might. This'll do. I'll be in contact to arrange the pickup somewhere down there. That'll be a fun landing. You sure about this? I've got a game to win. See? We're totally on the right path. We're supposed to be training for the Palma game, not going on some crazy treasure hunt. But that's the best part, dude. We can practice in the Lost Stadium. An actual pitch will be so much better than some hotel field. And it's not like we can go back to the way we came. You do know this is the worst plan ever, right? Chill. It's an adventure, dude. <sighs> Well, come on, Mr. Ventura. Lead the way. Okay, you were right. The Lost Stadium is real. Now come on, let's go do some long overdue training. Ah! <gasps> Ouch! Oh, hmm. So much better than some hotel field, eh, North? <sighs> yeah. all over the place. I can't follow it. Uh, oh, great. Stuck in the middle of nowhere and we can't train? Don't worry, guys. I'll use my junior wilderness cadet training to come up with a rescue plan. We'll be out of here in no time at all. We'll never get out of here. And it's all my fault. <sighs> Because I'm a fake! I got all my Junior Wilderness Cadet badges on the internet. Wait, you didn't even have to go outside? Well, I had the window open. It's totally not your fault, Klaus. It's mine. 
Being dominated by Don Aldo, it, it totally messed me up. But instead of facing up to it, I, I dragged us into some crazy adventure. Tracker in Sheringham. I figured he'd be the one thing you wouldn't leave behind. So, did you at least manage to do some training? Pitch is covered with roots. It's too unpredictable. Unpredictable, eh? Get some rest, boys. We train at first light. of looking good if your friends aren't here to appreciate your awesomeness. I kind of even miss Shake Smelly Socks. <sighs> no. Listen up, guys. If Coach says he's gonna find our brothers, he'll do it. And we gotta do our part by giving Palma the toughest game of their lives. We play our hearts out for the first 45. Keep the score at nil-nil. We can do that, right? Yes! yes. Then come on! Let's get out there and do it for our brothers. <laughs> yes. One, yes. two, <laughs> three, Super Super Strikers. Strikers. Game on! I've never seen Super Strikers use such a defensive formation. Not surprising, considering half their team hasn't shown up. What is Coach thinking? No idea. He's missing too. Can the reserve defenders stop the Samba King? Huh? They don't have to. Dancing Rasta makes a brilliant tackle. It's all hands on deck for Super Strikers. Even their most attacking players are helping out in defense. <clears throat> but my question is, how long can they keep it up? <sighs> We're almost at half time. Don't let it slip now. And here comes Paul Mentieri again. This must be the final attack of the half. And for once, Donaldo makes it past Dancing Rasta. Can the reserve defenders stop the Samba King? <laughs> nope, his movements are just too unpredictable. No! Ecstasy for Paul Mentieri, but agony for Super Strikers. second half is about to start, and we have unconfirmed reports coming in that... Brenda! Could it be? But the way North Shaw and Block played last game, Coach might be better off sticking with the reserves. And the second half is underway. After last game, I thought you two would run off scared. I'm gonna make you wish you had. Now remember, watch the ball, not the man. Coach, we tried this and failed hard. The pitch is too unpredictable. Come on, dude. I know this isn't ideal, but... We've gotta make the most of our situation, right? Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> 
What? Northland Block make the tackle! At the same time! Wow! How did they make Don Aldo look so predictable? Yeah! Rock! Awesome! <laughs> See? The unpredictable pitch is the perfect way to prepare for an unpredictable player like Donaldo. But how's it going to help us if we can't get back in time for the game? Don't worry about that. Our ride is almost here. But before we leave, I want to try one more drill. I've seen what the defenders have learned. Now it's the forward's turn. <laughs> with you, Coach. Actually, I've got one more job for you. This is how to soak away those aches and pains. Yeah, I think I just earned my ultimate relaxation badge. <laughs> Guys, come look at this. Remember when North said Alberto Ventura never made it out of the jungle? Yeah. That's because he spent the rest of his life chilling in this hotel. <laughs> it's just as well North isn't here to see this. I still don't get why he'd want to miss out on some mega relaxation. North hmm? hates this stuff, remember? So I gave him another chance to take on nature. You think you're gonna be able to handle this, Shakes? Yeah, I've been working on a killer new move. The only thing you're gonna hear from the Sultans fans is, no, how does Shakes do it? Ah! And what about you, Spenza? It's gonna be difficult to chant louder than them. Ha, you're talking to a super fan, son. We're the loudest in the business. Ooh, Nico's in a promising position. The Sheik wants the whole fans to make even more noise. That's even possible. This noise is unbelievable, Mac. What? That's it. I'm calling the landlord. Man, we've got a lot of work to do. Miko, what happened out there, dude? We were ready, prepared, but that sound. Come on, brother. You've played plenty of mega stadiums before. You cannot understand it until you are out there. Hmm. I've never seen Miko that spooked by, well, anything. That's why we're doing extra preparation to handle the Sultan's fans. Prof, 
You may be used to lifting uh, dumbbells, but today you will have to contend with decibels. What? Exactly. Decibels and watts are both ways to measure loudness. The first challenge when playing in front of a noisy crowd is communication. I've developed a series of, uh, hand gestures to use on the pitch. Learn them all. Sure thing. Or rather... Your budgie has toothache? Uh, perhaps I need a little more time to learn them. All right, superfans. Our mission... The Goliath. 200 restaurants, 130 shops, movie theaters, arcades, ice rink, petting zoo. I can't promise all of you will make Spencer! it loud. Super friend. <laughs> uh, just getting the crew G'd up for the Sultan's game. Let's focus on out singing the Sultan's fans, not out shopping them, yeah? <laughs> all right, guys. I've got some awesome new chants to try out. But first, warm ups. One, two, three. <gasps> Okay, boys, you've learned the hand signals. Some of you have learned the hand signals. The second challenge when playing in front of a massive crowd is how you handle the noise. Come on, coach, the fans don't make that much difference. Pros like us have perfect concentration. What are we talking about again? According to my calculations, this should be... A perfect simulation of the Goliath! His new move. Is a hostile environment like the Goliath really the best place to try a new technique? Let's find out. What was that? We didn't even wake up Sandra. Again, and this time, make it count. Ay, ay, ay. Mm. Whoa. Nice. This is great. Oh, right on. <laughs> Super Strikers, welcome to the Goliath. I have no doubt it will overwhelm you with its facilities. Food, clothes, accessories, cinemas, an ice rink, a petting zoo. Goliath has everything you could possibly want. And you, as my guest, can access it all with your very own personal GoPass. Whoa, thanks, Whoa. brother! Hey. Whoa. Very kind of you, Sheik. But the only thing we have time for right now is football. You taught him the hand gestures? The stadium is full of spiders? We gotta get out of here! Never mind. So, what do you think of the Goliath? Dude, I want to live here. So many awesome things to check out. Well, this all-access Go Pass might help. <gasps> I will only use this mighty tool for the power of good. And maybe some snacks. It's go time. <laughs> Match day at Goliath Stadium. 
And I have to say, Super Strikers are looking cool as ice. Say it? You have to shout it in this stadium. All right, guys. Let's show these Sultans fans how it's done. One, two, three. Super Strikers rule the pitch and we control the stands. Goliath Chiefs was had a chance against the Super Bats. Spenza. Oh, go pass. How oh, I love thee. Oh, man, I gotta get field side. But I'm not gonna last 90 minutes. Oh. It's go time. Super Strikers look to assert themselves early on. And so do their fans. You might as well admit defeat the balls and dancing cross the street. He's making shapes. And when he shoots, go deeper shape. I don't know what happened. I had that move down. Playing in front of all these fans is totally different to training. Maybe keep it simple next time, Shakespeare. Yeah, give the ball to the player with the perfect... Uh, concentration? That's the stuff. Ah, much better. <gasps> but I'm so late. Friends gonna be mad? Shortcut! Go time! Huh? Hey, I thought this thing was all access! The home support wanted Super Striker's attack! Now, can they help Sultans take the lead? <laughs> Not if North Shaw can help it. Go to the south or the east or the west, but if you head north, you'll be dispossessed. Wow, the Super Strikers fans are really doing their part. But there's nothing compared to this whole crowd. That's like Sultans have a 12th player on the pitch. What are you doing here? What indeed? This area is off limits to to everyone. Everyone. Uh, go pass. <laughs> and don't come back ever. ever. Wow, pretty decisive first half, eh, Brenda? Yep. The team with the most fans wins. Miko was right. You really don't know what it's like till you're out there. I don't know, guys. There's something weird about that noise. That sounded like a million people, not 150,000. Yeah, uh, where are they hiding, Shakes? The ice rink? Oh, the petting zoo. Go passes. Uh, don't actually have mine on me. 
The Go Pass is the only way to access restricted areas. Hmm. Huh? Oh, man! Spencer! Uh, Half time? Where were you? Uh, not sure exactly. This place is big. Endless corridors. Bottomless sodas. I'm sorry. I haven't been much of a super fan. But I promise to give 120% in the second half. Huh? Shades? There's old yogurt in my tog bag. Go fetch the itching powder. You say potato, I say potato. I've got it. Something weird's going on here. Use the go pass to investigate. Come on, friend. It's go time. Spence has stopped. What about your promise? Super Strikers need us now more than ever. Fran, being a super fan isn't just about what's in here or here. It's about what's going on in there. Okay, fine. Spends a PI. Let's investigate. Hmm, but we need a way to get past those grouchy scientist peeps. Go time. Working. Uh, uh, and it was then that I realized E must equal MC squared. Yeah, happens to me all the time. Rebooting machine for second half. Power okay. Amplifiers warming up. One hundred and fifty thousand fans weren't enough, so the Sheik added a few million decibels right underneath the pitch. Huh. No wonder Super Strikers can't handle the noise. We gotta shut this thing down somehow. I think I know how. You mean? It's go time. Game's about to restart. Let's see if Super Strikers can make more of an impression in the second half. Uh, unlikely, Mac. Just when you thought it couldn't get any worse for the men in red, their fans desert them. Shakes, what did you say to Spenza? Whatever it was, I don't think he understood the hand signals. No ghouls and no fans. Can things get any worse for Super Strikers? There's the signal. That's a go, people. Super fans. Let's do this. <laughs> Perhaps all Super League teams should build themselves a bigger stadium, Mac. Hey, scientist peeps. You can't be in here. This area is off limits. We're not going anywhere till we shut down that machine. Yeah! Ah! <laughs> Our decibel generator is made from titanium alloy. Titanium? It's practically indestructible. Practically. But we already know it's one weakness. Every machine's weakness. <laughs> Super fans, one, two, three, shoot!
The Sultan's chanting, it just disappeared. I know, what happened? They did. Even I know that hand signal. Come on, guys, let's win this for the fans. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Now, how about the classic? Count us in, Spens. One, two, three, four. Super Striker! Super Striker! Remember, Six, content. Ah, oh, never mind, you scored the goal. Super Striker! Super Striker! Hard luck, Shay. Yeah, I heard you had a sound strategy. Pity it fizzed out. <sighs> <sighs> Thanks. And I have something for you, Shakes. Uh, what's this? Your go pass bill. Okay, the bus is leaving. Gotta go. What? Who buys a hundred and thirty sodas? Goodbye,